I'm high. Yo, what is up, chat? I'm blue because I was supposed to record this video while driving, but as you can see, it's fucking pitch black outside. Like, what the fuck is that? So, today's video is about um, coming to terms with a lot of things in this life. Something you gotta do as a young nigga out here in the streets. Um, no, nah, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm coming to terms with um, a lot, bro. Come to terms with my lack of consistency. I'm coming to terms with my lack of sticking true to my morals and my letting myself down. And I feel like coming to terms with like I'm kind of letting some other people in my life down. It has nothing to do with just YouTube, like just things in general. Like I just feel like I've been blessed with so many things that I'm not treating my life the way I should for how blessed I've been. And the best way to put it is like the YouTube shit, bro. Like, I'm blessed to have 200 subs. I'm blessed to have all these view, like these these people I know in real life who are willing to watch my videos. On top of who else I don't know that's watching my videos. You know what I mean? And that's why I upload them. I don't upload them because I want to act some type of way or something. I upload them because I fuck with the things I'm posting. I fuck with what I'm saying. I fuck with what I'm putting online. And I feel like. You know, knowing that even one person, one person might watch a video I post in its fullest and might find some enjoyment out of it, might find some relatability out of it, or might even make their day or something. Just knowing that shit makes me so fucking happy and drives me and motivates me more than like, I think literally anything else on this planet. And I'm coming to terms with the fact that I'm fucking lacking and sucking ass. I've been sucking ass at this YouTube shit and since I've started, bro. And not by my video qualities, not by the type of content I upload. I'm so I'm so fucking inconsistent. I'm so inconsistent when it comes to YouTube, bro. And in reality, like, I don't do the YouTube shit for views or, or any of that shit. I do it because it makes me fucking happy, bro. And if I'm not doing it, then I subconsciously am less happy without me even noticing, which is crazy and weird. You're gonna be like, you're fucking cut on your mind, you're not your fucking mind. But it's the truth, bro, because you have so much time on this earth and you have so much time in these days and you have so much time in these weeks and you have so much time in these months. And no matter how much of that time might be wasted, no matter how much of that time might be go to work or might go to school or might go to gym or might go to whatever, you have more, nigga, you always have more. So it's like, I have all this fucking time and I'm not making videos, I'm not, Chasing these goals I want to chase. I'm not going to the fucking gym like I want to. I lost the fucking gym key, speaking of. But yeah, bro, like, I'm just coming to terms, like, with all of that. Just coming to terms with, like, the fact that the number one thing we have on this planet is time. And that's the number one thing I'm managing to fumble. The, man the number one thing I'm managing to lack on and fold and throw and just fucking throw in the trash like a dumbass nigga. But yeah, bro, just wanted to make this video to be like, bro, like, if you're out there and you're going through the same shit, like, obviously you are not the only one, bro. If you've had your time wasted, if you've been done dirty, if you've been fucking, like, I don't even know, bro, just going through a fucking, a rut, bro. You are not the only one, bro. I just said, bro, at least, like, 50 times in those last few sentences. And that just shows you how fucking passionate I am about the shit, bro. I tell you, like, I keep saying it, I'm not even noticing. Because it's like, if I'm talking and I'm saying the words that come to my brain as they come, instead of altering them, that showcases a level of comfortability. And I'm, I, dude, the fact that I can say bro in this video 50 fucking times proves to me that I do give a fuck about this YouTube shit. And I do like talking to y'all niggas. And I do want to be on this shit more. Because in reality, bro, I'm not going to be saying that shit to some nigga I don't want to talk to. Like, I'm not going to be just saying like, yeah, bro, whatever, bro. Like, I'm not going to be doing that. And it's just like the subtle things like that that really teach me, that, that really show me how actually happy I am when I am on this shit. But yeah, um, quick little car lore update. Like I said, I'm blood. I couldn't be driving for this video because I feel like that adds to the experience. I'm obviously fresh off of work. You can see I got the I Love Pizza shirt on. This hat's low-key clean as fuck. You can't even see. That's low-key clean. But yeah, bro, I'm coming to terms with just like a lot, bro. I'm coming to terms that I'm a real-ass nigga too. Like, it's not only negative things. You know what I mean? Like, and that's something I feel like everyone should come to terms with, like, you are so easily able to get wrapped up in these negative things like you might be depressed you might be sad but you also have to come to terms with taking accountability 
And that's something I'm coming to terms with every day as we speak, bro. And today I really realized, like, I do need to take accountability for the shit I be doing, bro. Like, more than anyone else. Because at the end of the day, it's me versus me. So, like, why, why not take accountability for the mistakes I've made in the past? And why not, you know, take charge of my life and, you know, be as decisive as possible and as as confident as possible in my decisions from now on you know what i mean you would call this a rant i don't know if you just call it to talk or whatever but i knew i needed to post something soon i was i had another video idea but i knew if i were to start that one and this is what happens with a lot of my videos like i know if i just wanted if i want to chase the idea i have it's going to take some time and i never wanted to sit down and do that fucking time because like i said bro like i've just been doing like i've been just fucking losing <laughs> in reality bro i've been fucking losing all right like I, and this is like weird bro because i'm a nigga like i'm a winner bro like i be winning most of the time like i've had my losses in life yeah but usually i have like big ass dubs i definitely did catch at least one double got a new car but yeah bro this is just about coming to terms with being like not only less than who i want to be but also more than who i want to be you know not, wait what bro shut the fuck this is not coming to terms with just me lacking but it's also me coming to terms with all the shit i've accomplished in my life and all the great things i've done and the man i am and all the friends i've had i've established and all these relationships i've gone through and this all of it bro like i'm coming to terms with all of it recently because like i said dude i haven't been on youtube and i've just been like fucking low-key drifting like really hard like, like yeah i'm in school and shit like i want to get done with school and make money from school and stuff but like obviously that's not all I want to do with my life. Personally, a lot of people are okay with just spending the rest of their life either just just doing shit that has to do with school, like nursing or being a doctor or a lawyer. But like, I, I don't know. I've never been that type of person only because I've gone along with people so well my whole entire life that I feel like if I'm not doing something that relates, that lets me speak my message, that lets me speak my truth or talk to people or at least help people make their days better, I feel like I'm wasting my potential. It might be just me though, but I do feel like I'm so good with people and I'm so good with words and I'm so good with just talking in general that even though I said bro like 50 fucking times in this video, I feel like, oh my gosh, oh, if I don't just get out and like, socialize and uh, and that's not my primary like like that's that's what i want my job to be is like socially or so bro i gotta end this fucking video bro socially <laughs> but no that's what i want my primary job to be something with socializing bro because i love talking to people that shit makes my day i cannot be around someone who cannot fucking talk for shit bro that shit drives me insane because it starts to get me mad because it's like it's like bro there's no way you're actually this ass at talking you know what i mean like like, you're just not fucking trying. I cannot stand it because I don't try, by the way. Anyways, that's a, <laughs> that's a video for another day. But yeah, I kind of want to do more car videos like this, too, because they're easy. <laughs> All right, y'all have a good one, bro. See y'all. Coming to terms with that big-ass